Hey y'all, it's T and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be going into our home theater and our kitchen to get our refrigerators clean, organized, and restocked. The main one that I really want to focus on is the one in the kitchen and that is because when it was stocked and organized we were on track and we made better food choices if you missed my refrigerator organization video you saw that i had it really put together and we were doing good but we kind of fell off but today i'm going to get us back on track but before i get into all of that i want to tell you about today's sponsor so this portion of the video is sponsored by New Air. They sent me over their 30 pound countertop nugget ice maker. And y'all, let me tell you, I am in love with this ice maker. If you love the ice from Sonic, this machine makes the same exact ice. It makes up to 30 pounds of ice per day. It is space saving and it has a self cleaning function. So there's two ways that you can use this machine. You can either connect it directly into your water line or you can fill it up with drinking water and let it make your ice that way. You can use this machine in your office, your kitchen, you can travel with it or you can move it around your home. What I plan to do is use this ice maker up in our home theater because it will be so convenient to have ice in the space that we entertain in so that we won't have to travel downstairs to transport ice upstairs. So this machine is so, so easy to use. You just fill it with water, hit the power button, hit the ice button, and it begins to make your ice. So if you are interested in this ice machine, I will leave my link down in the description box. Once you click on the link, you can use my code T10 to save 10% off of your order. So once again, I would like to thank New Air for sponsoring this portion of today's video. So I'll be starting off in our home theater and what I'm going to do up here is do a light cleaning in here. I'm not going to worry about the popcorn machine because my husband just came up here and popped popcorn. Sometimes we eat popcorn throughout the day. So I'm going to get everything wiped down, cleaned and restocked up here. So if you need any type of motivation to get some cleaning or organization done in your home, go ahead and put me up on your TV, your tablet, or your cell phone, and let's get this done together. y'all so here here are the items that i'll be using to restock everything up here i did have some items stuff so i didn't have to buy much today so as far as the water i decided to get mini bottles this time and these were on sale at Publix. buy one get one free really good deal on those and then from sam's i picked up our favorite which is the lipton green tea 
then the Welch's Juice, the Sprite Cherry Coke and Fanta mini cans. And then my husband picked up this um, Simply Spike Lemonade. Forgot where he got that from. I also picked up the Oreo um, Summer Treats variety pack. And then a box of my favorite chips, which is the Ruffles Cheddar and Sour Cream. So I'm about to get everything stocked up and then I'm going to vacuum the floor and do one more thing and then I'll be done. So I hope you guys are not getting tired of my opening song. I have officially made that song my opening song for all of my videos. It's just about every video I have either a comment asking who that song is by or how much they love the song or how much the song motivates them and get them started or if when they hear the song they know it's me. So that song will be here to stay until I find something <laughs> different. So I want to take this time to introduce myself. My name is T and on this channel, you'll mostly be seeing clean and motivation. You also see shop with me videos. You see home decor, home improvement videos, and any other type of video that I can think of that relates to my home. I will be posting it over on this channel. So if that type of content interests you, go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on your notification bells so that you'll be notified each and every time I post a brand new video. And also be sure to follow me over on Instagram because I post real-time updates and things like that over there so let's get back into this cleaning and restocking So to finish up in here, I will be bringing in some stools from downstairs from the kitchen. We just purchased new kitchen stools, so I'm going to use the current ones up here. It actually works out because the 
Um, smaller stools will work good for the arcade machine so we won't have to transport them across the room so there already be stools there and these actually work perfect with the table that we have up here So I'm going to show you a quick grocery haul of everything else that I purchased um, from Aldi and Publix. I already showed you guys the stuff that I got from Sam's earlier. So from Aldi, believe it or not, if you follow me over on Instagram, you saw that I posted this. Make sure that you are following me over there because anytime that I see clearance or anything like that, I will be posting it over on Instagram because by the time this video is uploaded, it will probably be too late. So I found these planners and y'all, I have been wanting these for a while. I actually been eyeing them in several different stores and they are still like over $30. And I was like, no, I'm not paying that. <laughs> so these were marked down at Aldi for $9.99. So I got all four of these for $40. They also had some other things like um, some lawn chairs, and um, like fire pits and things like that. I'll probably put it up on the screen. But once again, I did post over on Instagram. So be sure to follow me over there. So everything else that I got from Aldi is right here. I have a cantaloupe there. I have some nectarines. I have blueberries, apples, bell peppers, onions. I have some juice. Because, y'all, when I tell you that we were out of just about everything, we were out of just about everything. So, um, peaches, pears, um, plums, tomatoes, mini sweet peppers, some Parmesan cheese, some shredded lettuce, cucumbers, um, strawberries, some lettuce, other lettuce, different kind of lettuce, um, garlic and ginger paste some banana peppers, eggs, and then that's everything that I have from Aldi. Moving on to what I picked up from Publix. I picked up these um, Cuban rolls right here. If you guys saw that um, that viral grinder sandwich, we are just now getting around to making it. So that's why I have all of this sandwich stuff. Too excited to try it. If you've tried it, put it down in the comment section your opinion on it let me know if you like it dislike it or whatever all right so from Publix oh if this cake right here if you like the pound cake from Starbucks this is really close to it and it's much much cheaper and you get a whole bunch <laughs> so the, the pound cake I have some ham some turkey some red wine vinegar the submarine um dressing the cases of water the other one the other two are upstairs and then i have some pepperoni and salami and some prosciutto and kappa whatever this is but i heard it's good so i have that and then that is everything that i have from publix and then from sam's i bought all of those snacks that you already saw and then i bought these tomatoes tomatoes are so much cheaper at sam's because Aldi wanted like almost $4 for like a little small container. And I have this huge container right here. And I think this was a little over 5 So yeah, that is everything that I picked up from Aldi and um, Publix. So I'm about to get started on the refrigerators. So I'm going to get started with our fridge outside in the garage. We mostly keep drinks in here, but we also keep 
um, the overflow of food from the inside refrigerator, our main refrigerator, because we don't want it to be overcrowded. That's how things get lost. Things spoil and go bad when that happens. So we bring it out here and store it out here. So it's not terribly bad, but it does need a little bit of attention. So I am going to wipe it out and get some things organized. Couldn't do it without falling apart. So give me something, give me something now. Oh, oh, oh. Give me a fix, tell me it fix whatever that's wrong. So give me something, give me something. Stayed up 
Walk into the first light of dawn Just like fate without no warning previous refrigerator organization video i did get a lot of questions about my fridge and this type of fridge that i have is basically a fridge with a flex zone and what that means is the top of course is our refrigerator but this bottom right side you can have the option to either make it a freezer space or or you can adjust the temperature to make it an additional refrigerator space. So that's what we use it for. We use this portion of the fridge to store our leftover food from dinner and other leftover items that we may have. We stash it away on this shelf and in this drawer. So I will try to find a similar model because I'm not sure that they make the exact model that I have. I will try to find it and link it in the description box if you're interested. So this produce spinner that you'll see me using, y'all, I absolutely love this thing. Um, it really does work. I was skeptical at first, but it really does work. And I'll show you within the next upcoming clips. And I love storing my strawberries and different produce 
in mason jars to me it keeps a little bit longer and it saves space so i would like to take this time out to go ahead and announce my giveaway winners so my first winner is at home with lisa lisa she does have a youtube channel i actually watch her channel so you can go over and subscribe to her if you would like to so congratulations to you lisa and then my second winner is lee gomez congratulations to you lee so the both of you what i need for you to do is contact me via email my email is down in my description box you have a week to do that before i select new winners if i do not hear from you i'll go ahead and select two new winners and those winners will be announced in my next video so congratulations once again so if you are still here getting it in with me go ahead and put me down a green emoji any type of green emoji down in the comment section so that i know that you're still here broken Damage goods, damage should never been. Thought you were bulletproof. Look at you. What happened? Did she hurt you?
developing myself That thing of loving was for everybody else Lost and lonely, having hurt too many times Gave up on hoping, thought I'd never get it right
So before I get up out of here, I just want to thank you guys for the comments that you left on my video on last week. Y'all had me smiling from ear to ear. Some of them, they have had me tearing up. Like, they were just really, really touching. And it really touched my heart to know how you guys really feel about my channel. It gives me the motivation each and every week to keep pushing these videos out because sometimes it's not so easy. So I just want to thank you guys for your kindness, your support, you showing up each and every week to watch my videos, interacting with me in the comments and all of those things. So we are almost at the end of this video. So I'm going to go ahead and close it out here. I hope that this video gave you guys the motivation that you needed to get your refrigerators cleaned out, get it organized, get it stocked with some good old healthy food and all of those things. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video and I will see you guys in the next one. Sure, I understand it, but everything seems brighter now than before. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I feel this way, but every time I hear your name, all my worries disappear. Yeah, it's all because of. Fall in love so easily Cause I don't wear my heart up on my